ponies are waiting for breakfast. They're like, what's taking so long? Whoa, Sam moved the poop pile yesterday. I want him to push it all back on top of that one. 15 degrees, first thing in the morning. Is that cold? Hot. Good morning, do you know what's on your butt? You been sleeping? Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today is going to be amazing. It's starting out rough, but it's going to be amazing. I just I know it. Know Wake up. Get ready and go outside and see what God has planned for you today because every day holds the possibility of a miracle. Big or small, miracles happen every day. Me and I beat Gabby here only by mere minutes, which is rare. Usually we're here a lot faster than her, so that's how rough of a morning. I had so many things to do today. I am working on, I was working on a big huge collab with a couple other channels. So much fun. That video is gonna already be up by the time you watch this. Make sure you watch all three videos. There's three, three different channels. So much fun. Oh, we all hate, we all hate Finn's door. It's broken. Sam, when you're watching this, please fix Finn's door for us. We keep forgetting to ask you. It's annoying. This part is too far away. It yeah, it closer. needs, yeah, it needs to be fixed for sure. Anyway, I, the videos were all due to be, um, uploaded by today so i had to get up at six o'clock and finish that because just so much editing but don't think that that is a complaint because i love editing i love videoing like i used to watch so many channels and all the time they'd be like oh this is so much work and it is a lot of work but i love it like i love it his skinniness like you do have his skinniness are you mental no he's like all skinny you never eat so much food and he's pulling you can still see his legs. yeah so you guys should know that his dad i'll put a picture here if i can remember it's like a long lean fighting machine he's a multi-world champion <laughs> horse rider yeah i don't know he's a multi-champion and multi-reserve champion his dad his he dad like was that he yeah he won lots of money he's like a famous horse but he's dead now. But he's dead now. But we still have you, oh, Chino. Don't oh, be rude. I can jump on you all I like. What? We got Ruby, the girls, and the boy. The girls and Sam were the last one in the barn last night. Clearly, it's a mess. You shedding the girls already? Her. Her? That's from last night. Today is Friday, and this is the Friday of a long weekend. We have super fun plans this weekend. I'm excited. The other thing I wanted to say is that lots of times people, a lot of people comment whenever we don't do something like, Sophie's not riding, Sophie should ride her horse, Sophie's suffering, Sophie's not doing the right thing, Gabby's doing this, Gabby's doing that, and it gets frustrating, not because you say it, but because so many people say it. When you hear the same thing over and over and over again, it just gets hard. But then, yesterday, when Sophie rode Chino and jumped him and cantered him, and all the same people commented, bravo, well done, you're amazing, it made me realize something. It made me realize that even when you guys say the hard stuff, you also say all the amazing stuff, and I'm so grateful for that. And as hard as it is to hear the hard stuff over and over and over and over and over and over and over again, hearing the good stuff from you guys is like, life changing so i just wanted to say thank you so much for that for all of your love and support you have to pick all that up so they don't eat it our ponies are getting into a good shape we've been feeding them a little less so that they can go into summer feeling good fancy free yeah get it all off of her are those marks on him are those cuts oh no that's not that's sweat dried sweat where the girth was? Yeah. And what's that? Uh, today is so super warm outside. It's going to get really warm outside, like 18 degrees. Summer for us is like 25 to 30 degrees, so 18 is not far off. Like, it's getting up there. Except for it's going to rain. So, yeah, that that's a part of our day. Uh, we're going to lunge in just now, right now, and see if he's ready to go back out with the boys. We want him to go back out with the boys. For anybody who's worried that Sophie rode Chino instead of Finn, he's been lame. And um, we, are, we have a family of riding horses, and we're all going to ride each other's horses at various different times. That's just going to be our normal thing. I think Finn's feeling better. You think he's feeling better? Yeah, he lifted up his bucket. Oh, good. Wow. It's amazing how you can, like, rely on other things. Like, if you can... Like, I get such a good feel for my horses. I love that you can tell so... When you 
soul is lonely, sad and blue Ain't got no loving shoulders to lean on There's always a sunny side across the river Take a ride, take a swim and all your worries go away Go cross the river and you'll be fine Go counting winners, it's right down the line You'll be alright from sunny side Yeah, help me flip this, please. Right, we are, actually, should I do another coat? Oh, that one's a bit sticky. Let's just grab the white part. I can do it by myself. Move, no. move. All right. Stormy. No, finish yours, that's okay officially almost done the poles our jump poles we have one more red and so it'll probably take us another two days to get them all done but we have a busy day tomorrow so it could take us a little longer oh wait till I tell you what happened to Finn yesterday scariest thing lots of rope I am he's faster now because I have the whip how does he look Okay, I want to get out. Yeah. Whoa. Daddy said she can see better when she's walking. See, so he's still lame? All right, let's feel it. You can barely tell this way? But going on the left rein, going on the right rein, you can tell? Going on the, I don't even know what rein is rein. Yesterday, uh, you guys saw that Sophie was playing with Finn in the arena and she had his halter on him. She was training him to, uh, with hula hoops. It was no big deal. Uh, she was in here with him. We don't ever leave our horses with halters on ever in any field if we're not there. So anyway, um, Sam came and he got a mask. He got these really fun masks in the mail, and they Sophie, were cool. yeah, they were black and I love them. yeah, and Sophie walked out of the door to go look at them. So we were just like a couple of feet away, and all of a sudden we heard Finn like really shake this door, and we came running. Like we were gone for one second, I was, I and he had his walking. halter caught on this, and he was stuck on the door. Oh my gosh, like. Yeah, because they always put their head over the door. Yeah, we? but literally we were gone for one second and we were still here, like we didn't leave him, we were still here. We were like at Storm Storm. And he just did that, good. like, it's incredible how horses can get oh, hurt. Mom started screaming, yeah, I screamed. which scared him more, and then yeah. he started crying. Yeah, it was pandemonium for the whole 30 you seconds that it took us better. to get him undone. Um, it would've been better if this would move. It's, it'll like get stuck. Yeah, it's and it's weird to me that Finny is, yeah, he's still hurt. So. That doesn't affect him though. No, this doesn't affect him, but if that he got bit. No, but if he got bit, it's a good indication that he was fighting, that there and was fighting. Kicked, yeah, he probably got kicked too. He would have gotten kicked because he has a blanket on so it wouldn't show where he got kicked. Yeah, so. Unless their hooves were muddy. Yeah, in the past he has been kicked in the stifle. And there was a big bruise. No, in the stomach, right here no. by Stella. Yeah, and he I also got in the stifle, stifle before oh. too. Feel so bad when they're lame, but it makes me feel a lot better when we can put them in a different spot and get them feeling better. Literally thought this was gonna be a couple days, not like a week. No, come in first. I feel like somebody's sister snatching a horse over there. No, I have to like storm, or else I can't okay. bring the hay. No, rude. So rude. You go and try. We're needing another horse. Come on. 
That's what we do when we leave the horses. I go in the middle, Karen goes in the front, or behind me. Oh, the rain is coming. That's how I think Finney got hurt. I'm really glad we moved the poles inside this stall to paint them. It's been working out. Every time we come down to do chores in the morning, we do like a coat of paint and it's getting them done. Not super fast, like it's not. Painting poles is not a one day job. Right, that's exactly what I would do. Not. 
It's pouring rain outside. There's no shelter out there for the boys. So uh, we brought them to this smaller arena where they can go in and out and then we'll switch them over. Ponies out at nighttime. Finn's getting some time in his stall to heal. I think stall's better for Finn. I think stall's better for Finn too. Okay, so we made a bunch of changes. It's taking us forever to do the Naked barn chores. Naked horses are in here. Naked horses are in the barn. We got Finny who's recuperating. We got Gracie who's staring across at him she thinking, oh, I, oh, she's having a nap. And, and, then, and then we got Willow over there who's like, I hate being in stalls. That's first time in that stall. Yeah, that's, that's it's not a stall. Used to go in there with Stella. Yeah, she used to try and go in there with Stella. And then we got the big boys out here and they're able to go in and out. This is the problem. Storm gets mad when he everything is not comfortable for him and so he's mean to the horses. And this is where we think Finn got kicked. So they So yeah, like they can go outside or inside. There's lots of room for Chino to get away from Storm, but still it's not quite as big as a big huge arena. There well, or like outdoor. Yeah, they can't full on gallop without getting hurt. So that's a concern. But we also know that Storm will chase them around outside in the rain. Right or wrong, that's what we decided to do. We're able to separate everybody so that people, so the horses are dry, have a shelter on bad days. And I'm really grateful for that. Soon, the boys will be in the field eating grass and they'll have an outdoor shelter. shelter. Yeah, so Wait, we won't have to move them around. Are you making Storm's happier in here? Because then the rain can't catch him. Yeah, he is. All right, are we ready to roll? Yes. Yes? Just got to sweep up this little tiny bit more. And we are ready to go. I also was able to straighten up in our um, tack room. It's been kind of getting messier and messier. It's still not perfect. Still have a lot of junk in here. But I was able to sweep everything off. Clean everything up a bit. You ready for lunch? It gets almost lunch? lunch time. Almost. It's got to be. 10.37. That's 20 to 11. 11 is lunch for me. I am, oops, I'm trying to talk Gabby into taking her western saddle on the trail. No. Tell them why you won't take your western this saddle. western saddle is too slippery and I can barely trot or canter in it. And the English is grippy. Sophia's saddle is slippery. Right, so. My saddle is the grippiest thing alive. You don't get anything grippier. Also, um, I heard the stirrups on the western saddle are really long. Also, she, if there's any jumps, natural jumps in the woods, like she will. She wants to jump, she wants to gallop, and I told her she can gallop in a western saddle, but she doesn't believe me. And no, because it's too slippery. That's like the slipperiest saddle alive. All right. Imagine riding like bareback on a slippery, wet horse. So that's why Gabby's not wearing the oh, western extra saddle. Treats? No. Right, we are in, uh, Gabby and I are in the horse trailer because we are going on a trail ride tomorrow. Which involves we found Sophie's missing now. boot. Um, but basically, Gabby needs to clean it out. Well, you should clean out your horse trailer after every time you use it. We don't. Yeah, ours got really dirty. So when Fiona took Dad's truck the day after the horse show, no, yeah, the day after, <laughs> um, I had to clean it out because it was a mess. Yeah, Gabby was taking it with Fiona one day and that was like fine, you can only go if you clean it out. Yeah. Because you guys weren't home. a super fancy amazing horse trailer but it's literally I love it I love it so much this is two plus one and um for like sleepaway shows even though it's small you can put like small ponies this goes out like you can take it out and close that so it's two stalls yeah so it's two stalls so they can sleep for, in like, here small ponies not yeah you know, or storm no or fin or they can just run around while they're at a show yeah yeah, I love it. Like, I love this little area up here. Actually, we could do without this area. And if you have two horses that fight normally, just close the divider. 
My favorite thing of all is the fact that it, they can step on and step off. Like the back door opens for them to step on and then they yeah. walk off that way. Wait, and our horses love it. Teach your horse to back off. I know. Instead of load on. Yeah, and most horses have the most trouble with backing off. Storm did. Storm does. Storm has a problem with any other trailer that he can't go on and off. I know. All Probably right. Probably because it looks like a death trap because yeah. there's no door. Yeah. Can you get a seat from? She knows where she's going already. All right. Sam and I are on a coffee. Sam and I are on a coffee break. There you go. Thank you. This is my coffee. I don't drink coffee anymore, so this is my treat. Today is the start of a long weekend, so Sam got off at noon. Um, as soon as he walked in the door, I was like, let's go someplace. And I'm like, so stir crazy to go out and go shopping and do fun things. Um, we're getting close, you guys. Today, yesterday, last night, our government announced that riding lessons are back on. So we're, it, there's gonna be a bit of a time where our barn gets ready and implements all the new rules, but riding is coming back on. Like the trainers are gonna be back. We're gonna have riding again. It's gonna be amazing. I'm super excited. I know a lot of places in the States are the same. So Sam picked me up and we're picking up something. We're picking up something for, for our farm, something to make things a little bit easier for us. I'll show you when we get it. I don't wanna like show people that I'm videoing. But there it is. That's the new addition to the day by day farm. You see what it is? It's really nice. I hope it'll fit in my car. What, why didn't we bring the truck? It's a rototiller, so it's gonna like dig up all the grass and and for our garden. Ooh, I'm excited. I love it. I love it. One thing you guys may not know about Sam is that he always goes on these crazy cockamamie schemes and he's always like, oh I, I bought blah 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 and then like he always buys all these things secondhand because that's how you get the best deal and we'll go and we'll get it and we'll always end up in these crazy situations but one day I have to tell you about the first one day I have to tell you about the horse that he bought for Sophie it was like a crazy crazy story but anyways he has bought everything you could ever imagine he's bought and it's never been as nice as this rototiller this is a really nice one I love it and we got pizza for supper. You want crazy bread? Sure. Thanks. This is crazy bread and it's fresh out of the oven. It's so hot I can hardly even touch it. It's garlic bread. Mmm, it is so good. It's lunchtime, puppies. Ponies. I keep calling them puppies. Hello, Chino. Hello, Finny. Finn's like, you're late. Bring me the food. And it's true. We're about half an hour late. I hate being late. You know what's weird is that when you are when you vlog, like sometimes when I vlog, it's so awkward and I can't get into the groove. And then other times when I vlog, I'm totally in the groove. I'm not in the groove today. I don't like this whole week. I feel like I've been out of the groove. Do you want lunch? I hope you're being kind. I don't want any more lame ponies. I'm like nervous about leaving them in there now. Oh, hello. All right, let's throw them all from the hay. All right. Ah. Storm just grabbed the hay out of my arms. And now, what are we gonna do? We need two piles at least, Stormy. Never he does it. See, look. Chino looks scared. Why does Chino look scared? Because this is the thing, they're in a smaller area, so if Storm tries to run him off, there's not as much space for him to run. I know, it is muddy out there. All right, Storm grabbed it out of my hands. Look, two piles. I just want to look them over and make sure there's no marks on them. No marks on you. There's a horse with a body hanging off of it. I was going down. I was hugging him. I was like, I don't the did you guys see when we brought the boys back in? Did you guys see Stor Finn's no. calling for Chino? So sad. It made me so sad. Ponies are fed. Gabby's all in the lovey mood, a hugging mood. We got pizza. I'm in a mood. Oh, oh my gosh. 
I did the funniest thing this morning. You lied to me. So the girls are not allowed to be on their phones in the morning. I had to get up early and go down and edit this video that I was working on. And I went down, I had a shower at 6 a.m. I went down, I did all the, all the editing. And then I got a message from Sophie. I got a message from Sophie and it said, Mom, you're not in your bed. Where are you? And I said, oh, Sophie, I went, I'm down at the bar and I did all your chores. I did everything so you could just rest and relax today. You know what she said? What? I love you. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. When you get back here, I'm going to give you a hug. I'm like, I Sophie, it's a lie. I felt so bad. I was sleeping. You didn't say that it was a lie. So I did say it was a lie. She, just, she was so excited she stopped messaging me. So then when I said, Sophie, it was a lie, she like went on believing that I did all that for her. You said sorry. I was I, sleeping. Oh. Yeah, Gabby was sleeping. Sophie was just excited. She thought it was going to be the best day of her life.